Welcome to Figma Bytes, the video series that aims to teach you to speed up your Figma workflow. Today we're visiting an auto layout buffet to sample four goodies from our pizza toppings Big Bite. First up, the overflow menu that contains our advanced layout configurations. We can choose between spacing modes that make objects stick together versus spread apart evenly when resizing a frame. Here you can also adjust whether or not Figma includes strokes in the size values. We can also adjust how objects are ordered within an auto layout frame by choosing between first on top or last on top. The second auto layout goodie is the space between items setting, which can be set to a negative value to overlap objects in a layout. Third, we have padding shorthand. Type a number, comma, another number to represent top, bottom, or left and right. These can be any positive value. Toggling the independent paddings icon will show us all four sides. Fourth, we can force elements within our auto layout frame to ignore the layout rules by toggling on absolute positioning and moving it to where you'd like within the frame. That's a really tasty feature. I hope you enjoyed our auto layout buffet and learned something along the way. Thanks for watching.